Hello everyone. Once again, we're here to talk about what Falco Holsters has to offer. Now, just because they're known for their leather does not mean that they don't understand the benefits of other materials like Kydex. Often in our life, we mix hard and soft. Today, we're looking at the A116L and the C908L. As I'm sure you figured out, the L designation stands for light bearing. Both of these holsters are made for my Springfield Armory Hellcat Pro with a Streamlight TLR1 HL and a Vortex Defender CCW Red Dot. Hybrid holsters are not a new idea, but they are a popular one. The hard Kydex shell makes your draw quick and easy as well as reholstering because the material is so rigid. The leather backing has two purposes. The first is comfort. Walking around with plastic against your skin all day is nowhere near as comfortable as it is using leather. Leather is also flexible, which allows the... Leather is also flexible, which allows the holster to wrap around the contours of your body. Should I be showing features here or should I just only do that in B-roll? <coughs> Yeah, I think only in B-roll. Okay. As you can see, the A116L is the inside the waistband version. Let's look at this one first. The A116L uses two steel belt clips. What that does is spreads the weight out across a larger surface area on your belt, making it more comfortable to carry a heavy gun or even a light gun. Clips are available for one and a half inch belts, but you also have other options on the website. When you order, you have the option of a full sweat guard here, or you can just forego the sweat guard altogether. Hey, that's my fanny pack. Now let's take a look at the C908L. The 908L is the outside the waistband version. You might wonder why you need a leather backing on an OWB holster. When worn under a shirt, the leather sweat guard is still effective in protecting your skin from the gun and your gun from your skin. The TLR1HL is only one of 40 available lights. I'm using these holsters to carry my main carry gun, my Springfield Armory Hellcat Pro. The Hellcat Pro uses 15 round magazines putting it on par with some larger defensive handguns like the Glock 19. This gun is equipped with the newest red dot from Vortex. This is the Defender CCW in 6 MOA. One thing that I really like about this dot is the dot itself. Some red dots will have almost a burst of light. This one has an actual circle with edges and everything. And that makes it much easier to be precise. So just how fast are these holsters?
Something that I noticed right away on the range is how much quieter these are when you draw them than a full Kydex holster. A quick thing to note about the A116L, the Falco Holsters website shows it being used in the appendix position, which is how I carry 90% of the time. It would also be comfortable in plenty of other positions, 3 o'clock, 4 o'clock, 5 o'clock, 6 o'clock, 7 o'clock. A big benefit of the hybrid system is using that Kydex means there is no break-in period. So order yours, put your gun in it, and start carrying. Carry often and stay safe. Thank you so much for joining us. Mm.